Petri dish. The Petri dish. The Petri dish. This is the Petri dish. The Petri dish. The Petri dish. That's the Petri dish. There's something growing in here. And today <laughs> it is just general jocularity. I, 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 I'm wearing a hat. Austin's laying down. Jonathan got another haircut, or is it the same haircut from last week? You just got it moosed up. I don't know what's happening. Either way, this is a podcast. Yeah, same haircut. Just this kind of. This kind of looks like a Zoom call and like you're an eccentric billionaire and we're your two concerned accountants. This is oh. this is exactly what the fucking like John McAfee show when he live streams to YouTube <laughs> randomly. It's like him from the top angle of like a closet and then two <laughs> like very dissatisfied regular Zoom callers like you can't be saying that. <laughs> you can't <laughs> say you that PR legally department that's bad. on the line. Yeah. Also, I can't tell. Is that the microphone shadow on your shirt, or just a really huge stain? Both. This. This is. Okay. This is the last of one. This is the last of eight exact white T-shirts that I bought six years ago. Yeah. No shit. He's, this is the last one without any significant holes. So well, he's you stretched really it for uh, for quite a while. You stretched yeah. it in more ways than one, but also this, you stretched one... it out for quite a while. <laughs> This is the one. This is the only one that grew with me and didn't nice. uh, shrink means, in the laundry. Six shirts <laughs> over eight years, though. That's like a pretty good rate, I think. Yeah, yeah. honestly, For white shirts especially. Kirkland yeah. brand fucking white t-shirts. They build them beefy enough to last. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. probably like have lost two or three of them in the span of four months. You know, get like yeah. ripped up in the and like the yeah. the neck bit. Yeah, the yeah. sleeves start getting all chewed up. Yeah, or because uh, I'd be chewing on my shirts. Oh, uh, mine frequently uh, uh, get. Okay. Uh, what is it? The the TC Tuggers uh, thing uh, from for, the. Yeah. I think you should leave. <laughs> yeah, I get the same tugging fucking. Because uh, I'm just always adjusting, like I'm wearing an ill-fitting Starfleet uniform, except that <laughs> uniform is my skin. <laughs> okay. Nasty. A little bit of, a little bit of f- fun. Yeah. Well, you got the cowboy hat on. What's that all about? It was just next to my headphones, and yeah, I was nice. like, "That's the vibe. That's happening yeah. today." Yeah. I got to go to a birthday party later. Uh, birthday party is at a water park. I still have a second butthole, so I got to just like yeah. hang out and eat mozzarella sticks. So oh. I might just wear this cowboy hat out there. Nice. That's solid. That's a good plan. Yeah, I don't yeah. want to get pool water so in my butt. Now that's like a was that like a doctor recommendation to wear the cowboy hat? No, <laughs> to wear the cowboy hat. Uh, yes, on the cowboy hat. He did say, <laughs> uh, "Be comfortable and take it easy." Gotcha. And to me, that's what this hat says: "Take uh, it easy, take it easy." easy. Yeah. They don't have like yeah. just like a, a pool at like a water park where you can just kind of you know go knee deep in and just stand in the water. Well, I guess like, for, like the people? beginning of a wave pool, I guess, like where you just gotta like start walking in. Like you could just hang out in the ankle. Just hang out in that section. Yeah, and then it'll just splash like ankle to knee. Yeah. Yeah, because you can go to a water park and not pools. get wet. I might yeah, not get you, wet. Yeah, you can. Swimming well, pools are just crowdsourced the urinals. I missed that whole thing. What? <laughs> Swimming pools are just crowdsourced the urinals. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you don't want to get that in, in an open wound. It's pee pal. How do you, how do you crowdsource us? A, 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 it's a place everyone's got to piss into anyway. It's crowdsourced kind of by nature. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know. yeah. Unless the crowd also voted, this is my favorite piss spot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they should right, that in one of our magazines. Piss spots of Reno, Nevada. <laughs> oh. My own backyard. Yeah. Your backyard's pretty good. Yeah. 
I was going to say behind the Nugget is another good spot. Uh, beside Third Street used to be. Yeah, I, re- I actually really like the... all of the streets the, sometimes. Next to Third certain Street. Hours. Yeah. Yeah, next to Third Street is good. Um, Directly into the river from those stairs on the river walk. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just start pissing into the river. If they can throw toy ducks everywhere, uh, I could piss in there. <laughs> See, I'm telling you, it's a crowdsourced urinal. Hold on, I guess for for anyone who is not a Reno local, uh, every year I think they do a charity thing where everyone buys buys uh, a rubber duck in a race down the river. So then they release like two thousand rubber ducks into the river just to yeah, float yeah. down and have a race. It's like a charity uh, thing, and you can like bet on a duck. Yeah, and so you it's can like put it's money kind down of, on your duck. It's kind of fun can... if you don't think about what could happen, which is exactly what happened this year, which was the barrier that's supposed to hold all the ducks at the end broke and released <laughs> like a thousand rubber ducks just down the Truckee River. <laughs> no. So yeah. they've had to put together several separate charity events in order to clean up the river. <laughs> From their <laughs> own charity event. <laughs> oh, that's gold. So that's Reno for you. It's yeah, like that is Reno for you. Yeah. Like we're not environmentally friendly, but we know when we fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah. that one was wrong. That's wrong. Now we can Pretty fix it. Now we, we know it. where the line is. Don't yeah. release a bunch Don't. of ducks into the river all willy nilly. Don't do that. Yeah. Yeah, cross that one off the list. Where, where, where does the uh, Truckee River turn? In? Probably onto some random native land that they don't care enough about. Oh. I can imagine. Gotcha. Okay. I just like that has to be it because no one ever talks about like oh there's this amazing lake that the Truckee River feeds down into. It's like oh. no, it's coming from the cool place. Okay. This yeah. river just kind of its way into Nevada. Okay. And now it's full of ducks. Yeah. It flows to it a is. pyramid, no? Yeah. Isn't that what it is? It flows from one lake to another. Does it flow to Pyramid Lake? I just looked at a map. It showed that it was flowing to Pyramid, so. Okay. Well, that's why, pyramid that lake, that's why Pyramid Lake fucking sucks. Um, I've never been. You've been out there? I mean, no. you can't go out there with your cyst scars right now, but yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna wet. go take a take an investigation day. I've been there twice. And, not good times. Uh, both times, I could only think about how, for the same distance, basically, I could have just gone to Truckee. Mm-hmm. Um, like, man, there's no pyramids out here. What a jib. It's like, do I want to go hang out in Fallon or Sacramento? You know, like, I'm probably going to get more bang out of my buck from Sacramento, so I'm going to go the other way. Oh, yeah. you're saying that because they got Ikea out there. Yeah, the meatballs are so fucking good. I still got a bag in the you. freezer. You haven't tried one of them oh. Fallon meatballs. <laughs> I just, I can, just only imagine on the, the street. I can only imagine the Fallon meatballs are full of more horse. It's just armadillo. <laughs> It's just uh, raw armadillo. You take a big old bite out of it. Did you guys know that the wild horses around here are like an invasive species? No, I didn't no. know. That. Yeah, they're they, all, uh, they aren't they're supposed all to fucking be here. Okay. Where did that's they come why, from? That's why they're such such a nuisance. Like, did we put? Did we try and do like a horse race into a river, and we they accidentally uh, breached the net, and so I now did, they're just loose? In I'm the... assuming it's some fucking Nevada shit like that. They just brought it over from Utah or something. Or horses a Utah thing. I, I think it was well, I, I think it all originally stems from uh the Spanish coming in from Central like, America and just yeah. breeding horses all willy nilly. Yeah. Uh and like the either they made their way up here from that, or someone was like, I can bring even more horses, even more north, and decided to come breed them specifically just in this valley to fuck people up. Well, yeah, that's a cool, species. fun fact. All right, I, I Fuck learned them horses, that. Then. I learned that after there's apparently like a there's there's like an initiative right now to try to 
have less of them, but they can't just be like horse hunting season because of how like <laughs> not cool that is in America. So they're trying to find different ways. And one of them was just like releasing a bunch of wolves on the, like, like trained dogs were taking down and hunting the horses. So they're like, okay. it's not a crime if we make another animal do it. Yeah. It's not <laughs> illegal in wolf law. Right. Yeah. We'll make the wolves do it. Yeah. Yeah. These goddamn yeah. human jurisdictions. Yeah. The legalities <laughs> of killing I, horses for us advanced creatures. I love the way that that works in whatever conservationists like, around what a, here's brains. Like, what an awesome loophole. Yeah, they're like, hey, 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 guys, if we do it, it's like second hand. And so no one can, what are they going to, are they going to sue the wolf through us? Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like when that With monkey their horse that lawyers. <laughs> yeah. There could be horse lawyers. There's that horse man show. Yeah, Bojack Horseman. Are you saying yeah. Bojack Horseman is proof that horses can be lawyers? <laughs> yeah, he's not a lawyer in that show. He's, he's not actor. even a lawyer. He's an actor. He's a com he's a comedian. <laughs> now Harvey I'm... Birdman. Bird. Yeah, I'll trust a bird as a lawyer because birds have been proven to speak. Um, and maybe that bird, his owner, was a lawyer? Okay, yeah. They could just repeat stuff. All yeah. right. It's like, you're on trial for a murder you know you didn't commit, but you looked at the evidence too, and it's like, coincidentally, real close. Even you're like, damn, they got me, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. You have to choose your lawyer now before you go into this thing. You ah. you start to feel guilty, even knowing you didn't do it. Do you want a bird as your lawyer, or do you want a dog as your lawyer? Bird. Bird. Yeah. That's bird like a dog. I mean, have you seen that Shaggy Dog movie? That's a <laughs> movie about a dog lawyer. I mean, a dog has played basketball. A dog, that dog has... That dog punched a dude in that movie. Have you seen that movie? <laughs> the Shaggy Bird. Dog? The, the original one? And the Shaggy DA. No. Yeah, the Shaggy DA is what I'm thinking of. Yeah. Oh, fuck. There's a scene in that movie where that dog, like, gets up and, like, turns around and punches a dude in the face. And it's cut. So you, so it looks like the dog runs up and With his just, little paw. just fucking jabs him. But it's like a uh, puppet arm that comes out and hits the dude. Uh, there's, <laughs> been, there's been great dog interviewers, like, uh, fucking, what's his face? Conan, what's that dog's name? Triumph? The insult yeah, comic Yeah, Triumph, dog? the insult comic Triumph. dog. I kept thinking of Courage the Cowardly Dog, and I was like, wrong words, correct rhythm. Yeah. yeah. That is, no, that's right. Triumph. He is a, he is a uh, MC interviewing dog. Who is the dog Wishbone? Wishbone. That's the oh. story of Wishbone. Wishbone was read a, a lot of books. Like a TV show, like a children's book or a, something? A yeah. scholar uh -huh. and a gentleman, that Wishbone. Was he yes. like a detective dog? Was Wishbone a detective? I, I don't, think he just read a lot. I oh. think he just read. Yeah, he would be a detective if they were reading like a detective novel. Right. Oh, so like it would be in the dog's imagination? Like they'll be reading yeah. to the dog? So Wishbone would quantum leap into a character in the story. Oh. Yeah. And That's he fun. would be like, row, row, you know. <laughs> I don't yeah. know enough about Quantum Leap. And then the dog has Down Syndrome, and they're like, I just remember that episode of Quantum Leap? We don't need to go oh. into it. Remember that clip scene. is out there. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's got funny little music beds under it, too. If you look Real on TikTok. dramatic. Real funny ones. <laughs> it just says Seinfeld bases into the commercial. <laughs> Someone make that clip. I'm not going to do it because that's that's too far. But it's not too far for someone else to do it. Jonathan, you do it. You're going to be the new king of Twitter, right? What? No. <laughs> I'm just, I'm king just Twit. Trying to, no, I'm just trying to learn how to insult Donald Trump continuously. So he gets terrorized <laughs> like we did when he was president. I yeah. love... I love that Twitter has been 
exactly yeah. the same for 12 to 13 years. Mm -hmm. yeah. And it is only now you realize that you can just tweet at whoever. The feature that's existed the entire time, that's the part that impresses you about Twitter now that you actually look at it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I was not into it when it was a good working thing. It, it takes but a good decade that, for those yeah. things to sink in, you know? Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you would have waited long into the disco era to be like, you know, maybe the Rolling Stones were all right. <laughs> you go back to their first album. You're like, hey, okay, I could have dug this. <laughs> no, no, the Stones are the best, man. They're sure. so good. Yeah, there's no way I could come close to you. It just sounds like you got nothing to lose now. You should be just uh, uh, directly tweeting the CIA. You should do that too. Yeah, oh, tell them okay. you've got a. Tell yeah. them you've got a bomb. I'm like, hey, CIA, suck on this. D you know, I've got like, D's nuts. Post for a picture you. of your balls or something on Twitter. Yeah, you can put you can put full you dick. Can put on anything Twitter. on there if you want. Yeah. Oh, you can. You can you can just retweet pictures of your own dick with Donald Trump tagged. Or retweet other people's oh. dicks. We're and just tag saying, Donald Jonathan, you got to get your balls out for us. Come on, stand up, get them out. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> this bit's gonna go on multiple weeks. Get up and take your dick out. <laughs> We still got to get you an ass tattoo, but I still like the idea of it being the podcast name that we don't use anymore. It would be yeah. so funny. Yeah. I'm I'm down with that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what? Uh, yeah. If I pulled my junk out, it just isn't impressive at all. I think Zoom might auto blur your junk. I don't know if there's, uh, I mean, it, it already knows when you raise your hand. Yeah. Is that what those updates are for? Because like mine took a weird minute little to load thing up. At the bottom pops up to show you that someone is raising their hand. You can also do a thumbs up, uh, okay. and then uh, Bukaki. Am I okay? Oh, oh, I see. oh Austin Stop is surprised. Yeah. See, this is this is this is the kind of bits that uh that we need to do more of, so that people I'm, stop listening to us on Spotify and go straight to YouTube. What is this um, one supposed to mean? Like an angry little kabuki <laughs> face? I don't know. Angry kabuki face? Yeah, that's my feeling towards this whole um, <laughs> discussion. <laughs> I did it. Oh, yeah. Wow. All right. You know what time it is. It's time for you to not laugh about stuff. Okay. I that makes me feel like this. <laughs> is that the moon? It's like a black face moon. <laughs> <laughs> the dark side of the moon. Is 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 that what that song is about? Black face moon. Black face. <laughs> yes, Jonathan. <laughs> <laughs> so what's happening now? A uh, hot test coming your way. After I bring this guy bigger. Here we go. I'm going to say something to you right now that I've never said to another living soul in my life. Good. Was, was mm -hmm. that an actual language? Yeah, that was regular English, Jonathan. What? No. Next! Oh, you're my friend now. We're having soft tacos later. Nice. You guys want to have soft tacos with a little lamb? I had some soft tacos this week. Hell yeah. Taco oh, Bell. Oh, soft tacos. Soft tacos with lamb. If I was yeah. going to get soft tacos with anyone, it would be this person. Okay. <laughs> Okay. I feel I like one. I'm gonna see that. My vote. Mom's house. Yeah. My vote goes to that one. That's the funny one right now. 
Hell yeah. That one's leading the race by like I a mean, mile. It has, it has everything. It has puppetry. It's got everything. It has parody. It's, it's got a, it's got a tinge of suspense. And un, there's an uneasiness to it. Yeah. yeah. Weird hair. Unnatural. Yeah. That's what that's the post premiere TikTok. Oh, I already did this one. Yeah, we did this one. And I just... Hit my babe. Play on phone. Change genders. Love Obama. Make me woke. Country roads. All right, here's a real big horse fart. Yeah. And people like I don't get it. Yeah. Fuck them. Feed them to yeah. the dogs. Right. Is that why you hate horses, Jonathan? It's because they fart? No. I mean, one of the reasons why I don't like horses is because of Drew hitting a horse. That's and... true. Horses killed our friend. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. No, that, was, that was so many friend deaths ago, Jonathan. Keep up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it matters, though. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. fuck. I am sick and tired of these high gas prices. I mean, look at this. Joe Biden, you need to do something about this. I can't afford that. Had to sneak in a little bit of piss. Okay. I was. I, I was think I had a little stuff. too much Dr. Pepper. What gets me every time is the sink is missing. <laughs> I just didn't... I was think he building I Legos had a or something? Too much yeah. Dr. Pepper. Yeah, there is a sink. That's just taken out. No, it's just taken out, huh? Oh, all right. And of course, this one's cheating because it's meant to be comedy. Uh, and so is this last one. But nonetheless, it's beautifully crafted work. In 2005, the Teletubbies were executed after Dick Cheney ratted out the rest of the gang for this slaughter. John. John. All right, Robin. Boston Legal for 600. In Greek mythology, burglar and murderer Dick Cheney won this prestigious prize. Cindy. What is the America Cup? Say it again. America Cup. Say it again. America Cup. No. 9-11 burger. John. Who is John? Right. Two clues left. Which one? John? Which one? I love me some geo parties. Yes, I do. It's nice to see you two poops that finally moved into the TikTok realm. Yeah, and they there's really that, like this is a whole channel of just Jeopardy ones. Yeah, and there's 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 so many now that sometimes sometimes I'll just go to their TikTok and see what weird specific niche theirs is. mm Hmm. And it's usually just like, oh, this one is you this might... guy does a weird burp at the end of every single yeah. one. Yeah, you might find like a NCIS one. Oh no, we've murdered Jonathan. Uh, there he is. No, he's contemplating whipping it out. That's what he's doing. He was no, looking down no. at his crotch and thinking, like, it is big enough yeah. for this camera. <laughs> my my mom called me um, while the the TikToks were going. I was texting her back to tell her I was podcasting. Tell her you were about to whip your dick out on camera, and she just I... keeps calling. She's like, don't do it. Did you describe <laughs> the horse fart video to her? Yeah. No. Can't mom horse fart. No. Does your mom also hate horses? Because they, cause they killed our friend so. Drew? <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think she hates horses. Okay. I, don't, I don't know how she feels about horses. 
Do they not have a there's no wild horses in North Carolina, are there? There's a lot of deer, right? Deer and like elk right. and there's deer. Hooved but animals the live out horses there. Horses are main. Plenty of hot studs though. Yeah, I bet. Yeah. What's <laughs> the happiest what's the Jonathan, what's the happiest gay bar in North Carolina? <laughs> I have no idea. Okay. With that mustache, you need that information. Oh, yeah, I figured I'll just find him. Uh, mustache also. is gay now. <laughs> That's true. Can't have a mustache and not have gay culture in your bones. Yeah. Oh, this is how it works. It's oh. like a skirt for your face. It's it's been my wife's goal to have a mustache here, and you got it. Yeah. Yeah. Life achieved. You did it. Yeah. But I did know that that was like inherently gay. <laughs> it's not it's not inherently it's gay. Not. It became just... gay throughout your life. Oh. Maybe you are part of it. You did it. Good job. I don't think so. I don't know. Yeah. No. Well, he bonked himself straight. That's unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uh, so, uh, one thing I did this week. Okay. Is I. Is I started. I started playing. There's a specific map in custom StarCraft. Okay. That I used to only be able to play online when I was like 10 or 11 years old. And it is a playthrough of all of the sagas of Dragon Ball Z within oh. StarCraft. That's weird. Yeah, so I found in the new StarCraft, StarCraft 2, someone has remade that very niche map. Oh, and I can find upwards of four or five people playing it like every two or three days. And nice. then I get real excited and I jump in and I start playing and it's just like old times. But... That's Right. It's like so many it's so many layers of nerdy. I didn't know how to go about like finding how to play this game again. Yeah. So it's weird to just be able to play it again after like a decade of just being like, well, I'm never going to be able to play this again because it was a custom online map from a game from 1997, you know, <laughs> like no one's going to give a shit. But so yeah. Upwards of a dozen people did give a shit, and it's uh, it's great. <laughs> I'm very happy. Yeah, that's yeah. great. Good. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Sometimes you just gotta jump in the nerve with both feet. Just big you. You gotta find your little virtual tribe, and it's cool that the it's still yeah. it still exists out there because oh, Starcraft yeah. is still as just as popular as it was. Whenever it was released, I was never Star Trek, Starcraft, or Star Trek really, but. Uh, <laughs> I fucking love Starcraft. Space. Was, yeah, Starcraft wasn't really my jam. Like the whole real time yeah. strategy stuff. Oh, yeah. Outside of maybe like one or two licensed ones. Like I know Lord of the Rings had a couple, and I yep. I loved those ones. Oh yeah. I could never do like the high fantasy sci fi stuff. Oh yeah. I fucking love that shit. Yeah, you love that shit. I like. You love I micromanaging. Like... Little like, guys to shoot other little guys. Anytime <laughs> that I, there isn't a hero and it is just a zoomed out map and you have to play over just multiple generations of people, I'm yeah. very happy. Are you like a big civilization person too? Or like, Sim I City? don't, like, I don't like, like that civilization kind of as much. Um, but I, I usually go for weird ones like the double fine game, Massive Chalice. Oh, or yeah, some of those other like that. top down strategy ones like XCOM. <laughs> those are real fun. Master of Orion 2. That's an old ass one. That's space and I love it. Stellaris. I don't they're making know. us <laughs> Yeah, there it's <laughs> not only our strategy still games plays already snake on his niche. phone. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> he well, just found out you could use Twitter. He just found out you can you can put in a cheat code on your calculator to play Centipede too. <laughs> <laughs> you could also put a cheat code into your calculator for it to say boobs. <laughs> the code is 8085. 
Yeah. Well, 80,000 to 85. I know that one. I got some other calculator hacks to show you then, Jonathan. Okay. I'm going to blow okay. your fucking mind. Okay. <laughs> when I flip this calculator upside down. Yeah. I'll show you all a whole <laughs> new world of words you can make with numbers. It's why they <laughs> called Austin T1. They call me the T1000. Because yeah. I'm shape shifting. The Texas Terminator. These numbers no. into boobs. Boobs. It's <laughs> boobs. Yes. Good. You can boobs. also do hell. Do you know that you can do hell? H E double hockey hockey sticks? Yeah. 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 That's like four three eleven. Oh shit, three yeah. eleven. Amber is the color of your Yeah, I would down, say down. The, the problem with 311 is that oh, you were from from Nebraska like this. Oh. Are they from Nebraska? <laughs> yeah, they're from Omaha. Oh they got God. that Omaha styley. Omaha Omahanian. Mm-hmm. Is oh, that how they I don't know. I, I'm assuming it's something dumb like Omahoans. Okay. But oh, Omahoans. What's my homin? What's my Hoans doing? Omahoans. Yeah. Yeah. Omahoans. I something something. Almost got it. Oh, on my bones. Hell yeah. Yeah. More writing. Rapper. Freestyle. Freestyle. Ten minute yeah. long freestyle, Jonathan. Go. Oh. oh. Ten minute long? That's nobody wants that. It's crushing it's it so be far. Be staring. Staring. Stack staring in the space. Trying to pick up the pace. Pace. Hell yeah. That's great. Yeah. Ooh. All right, we did it. <laughs> okay, yeah. made it two lines in. That was that was great. Yeah, I That's believed in you the good. whole time. We'll have Bobby huh? produce a beat for you or something, and then you can. Yeah. Uh, we're going to turn yeah. you. We're going to turn you into need. a SoundCloud you need, rapper. You need the okay. you need the music music track underneath okay. to get in the groove. Let those juices just flow. Just say whatever you got to say. Yeah. What would your rap name be, Jonathan? Oh. Uh, Probably John Mayer, because I would say, <laughs> but say spelled like the gonna, mayor. You'd be Joe Rapper John different. Mayer. Yeah, yeah. Spelled with an O. I'd be yeah. John President. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. John Prez. I'd be, Prezi. I'd be, John Prez. I'd be John, John Mussolini. Mussolini. Prezi John Mayer. That should be your name. Okay. The dollar Prezi sign instead of Z's. Yeah. yeah, dollar signs instead of Z's. Well, actually, no, the Z's just look like dollar signs. They put the, I guess that's the Zell logo, so maybe not. Oh, yeah, the Fuck Z's it. With get the sponsored by it. Zell. Be the oh. first Zell sponsored rapper. Yeah, yeah. But John's yeah. all lowercase. Prezi, yeah. John, Mayor. Mm-hmm. And then for some reason, there's like a period at the end. Oh. Yeah, that's yeah. how the kids do it now. Punctuation is very in. Is it? Exactly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Especially periods. What's that one? What's that one? Isn't there a band called Fun, period? And that's all it is. They've been broken up for longer than they were together, I think. Oh, shit. Well, what's oh. a more current reference then, I guess? <laughs> Someone help me. Oh, fuck. Jonathan, help me. You know oh. modern music. Yeah, Jonathan, quick. Name a new artist with a period. Well, stop, playing, stop playing Centipede. Help us out here. <laughs> Pull out your dick. You gotta show us your balls, Jonathan. Come on. No, no, no. No. Yeah. Okay. It was, it's gotta be something cold. If uh like maybe Prezi well, John I, Colon Mayor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like that. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if punctuation's in, you've got to, you've got to get a cool punctuation. You and know? The colon is, col- the colon, colon is what really, yeah, that it really speaks to you. Yeah. Colon. Uh, yeah. Prezi John colon Mayer. Now, yeah. is just the John Mayer part lowercase and Prezi is all uppercase? Is that what we're going with? 
I would say like pre well the, just the Z's and Prezi are uppercase. Just the Z's in my mind. Yeah. I'm seeing the Z's as uppercase Z's. Yeah. And there's gotta be three Z. There's gonna be a three a third Z, but that one's the third Z's. one is lowercase though. Middle yeah. one? Uh yeah, I'm or feeling the, the middle one. The end one. I was almost thinking, yeah. I mean either way, that's kind of funny either way, I think. Yeah. Having I two think, capital I think Z's. The, the last one I kinda like. Uh -huh. As a well, lowercase. Yeah. Yeah, me right. too. We did it. Jonathan, what's the first yeah. song going to be? Uh, <laughs> what's your first single going to be? Is Prezi John Mayer? What do you think the What do you think the the name of it's going to be? Are you going to go Panic at the Disco style and make it a full ass sentence? No. Are you going to do like Kendrick Lamar and make it all like weird, just like one word, but then you fuck up the word in like nine different ways? I don't know what that means. Perfect. Yeah. I think I'm going to name it Waterfall. And <laughs> Are you just looking at things around your room again, Jonathan? <laughs> yes, I am. How are we going to exploit you to the internet if you just keep giving us the things in your room? I don't know. I don't know. I nope. don't know how we'll exploit me to the internet. You'll be hearing about this from Donald Trump on Twitter. <laughs> oh, God. But first, you gotta I share that horse farting video with him. Yeah, share I the horse fart video. Oh, just put it in. Just put it in there. That's actually the the horse fart's gonna be the backing beat to his first song. It's <laughs> gonna happen. Nice. It's just gonna be. Or it's just the song, and it's just made up of clips of the horse farting. <laughs> That's the whole thing. And it's, then it's it'll just, be like real just, nice just, jazz piano and raindrops in the background. Yeah. Can you can you remix the horse fart into Darude's Sandstorm? Definitely. That would be awesome. What? And then have Jonathan rap over it. Rap. 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 Christmas presents. It's crap. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Sorry, I'm yeah. pushing my penis. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I do that with Jonathan raps, too. I mean, when Prezi John Mayer raps. Hell, I inspire all the kids. Touch their genitals. <laughs> Don't say that. I think I got a foot fungus or something. That should be the name of your first uh, track. You got a foot fungus on your dick? <laughs> no, on my foot. foot it's fungus? like a rash or something. Okay. Yeah, just got a little a red, red spot. Can't handle it on the stacks. You don't know what to do. Gonna rhyme about you. No. It's a gold bond on it. Yeah. Sponsored by Gold Bond. Sponsored by Zell. Yeah. That's that's what you need, Jonathan. You need to be a spokesman for Gold Bond medical creams. Hot Zarbies. Gold Bonds? Mm-hmm. Gold. You know, the anti-itch. Yeah. Salves and solvents. Powders. Speaking of moist regions, uh... I've been get I've been fucking with Arby's real heavy lately. Nice. Ooh. Um, but well, here's the he, go to? well. Here's the conundrum I face. Okay. I personally believe that Arby's is the wettest sandwich in the game. Right. Okay. Uh, yeah. No one can get as moist as Arby's beef and cheddar, uh, especially ooh. with the array yeah. of sauces: the cheese sauce, the Arby's sauce, and the horsey sauce. That's mm -hmm. just a big sauce pocket. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My fiance enjoys things extra saucy. Mm -hmm. Okay. She's always got dips for things. Everything always got to have a sauce. But she didn't like the Arby's beef and cheddar. Oh. Fla like flavor wise. I think she she's down with the wetness. Okay. Which is what I thought would just bring her right in. And she's also yeah. down with the horsey sauce. I, I really like the horsey. It's a great sauce. It is. It's very good. It's like horseradish mats. I'm just trying to. I'm trying to find a correctly wet sandwich in the Arby's catalog that fulfills uh, all her needs for a sandwich. I tried the Reuben. The Reuben is an okay choice. Yeah, the Reuben's pretty good. Why did Arby's start trying so hard? Because they did. They did it. 
Like that first recession in like 2009, Arby's was like, all right, fuck it. Let's turn this ship around. And they just started yeah. killing it. Okay. Yeah. I love Arby's. Yeah, I think Arby's is pretty good. Yeah. They it's got all right. good style. I've had it once or twice this year, and I've just gone for the, the heroes, I think. The mozzarella the... sticks are king. Right. The mozzarella sticks are good. The hash pretty solid fries. fries. Are good. Yeah, the curlies are good. Yeah, curly fries are good. Yeah, they've got crinkle cut fries that are good. They yeah, do a pretty do. good turnover, too, if they deliver it. Right, if they don't forget. <laughs> if they don't forget the fucking delivery. Yeah. Man, I, uh, I once wrote a country song about Arby's. It starts off as a love song, and then you quickly find out that it is a love song sponsored by Arby's. Uh, and then it just kind of ends as an advertisement to Arby's, but I fucking love. I love that was that the first line of that go. Uh, let's see. Mm, I'm only remembering the other song. It's something about like dancing under the dancing under the 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 lamplight. <laughs> it's like it starts off as like a cutesy country story of like, ooh, I was so broke we could only eat at Arby's and we danced under the lamplight because we're just some broke country kids. And then it just keeps emphasizing like what they ate at Arby's and how good the deals were. And then nah. it eventually unravels <laughs> into just being like, try their and new Arby's, try their Arby's new song. sandwich line. <laughs> Don't forget about their great sauces and their shakes. And then that's how the song ends. Yeah, I I had an old recording when I, uh, I think it was one of the last Nick and Bobby shows we did in the Pioneer. I made like little bootleg CDs with four watches and uh, Dusty Fold songs on it. Uh And I just found the CD again recently, but I don't have a computer with like a CD drive anymore. (laughs) Whoa, first world problems. I just gotta oh, like, when did that happen? What happened to all the CD drives? Well, I have my did old your computer laptop. change gender or something? <laughs> I got my brother in law to fix up my old laptop that has the CD port on it, so I'll be able to get those off of okay. there. They're like okay, in, nice. imprisoned. Hold on, I think I have the yeah. CD over here. Yeah, they they have USB um, CD drives. That you can get. That's what I got to use for this guy because it's an Apple thing, Apple product. Nice. Yes. Cool. Dusty Fold. It had hey. weird. What's the track listing on that? Uh, the first one was our weirdness calibration. It was like an in between bit where I just like played a bunch of annoying shit on the guitar and then made sex noises over it. Mm-hmm. Uh, and that goes into Giant Asian Cowboy. Yeah. That goes into a song called Kinda Small about how uh, my dick is tiny, but we can still have sexy fun other ways. <laughs> it's a great oh. country song. Yeah. Kinda small, but that's okay. We don't need it anyway. It's great. <laughs> it's so catchy. Then yeah. four is just called Blam Blam. And that's oh. just, I was just making the sounds of classic rock badly over detuned acoustic guitar. <laughs> okay great uh the fifth the fifth one is the arby's love song it's just called love yeah and then the last one is four watches booty song booty it's just yeah. tossed in there that's the song that's just the entire beat is gunshots and i just <laughs> make like a bunch of Yu Gi Oh and shakespeare references yeah okay it's fucking weird it was cool that's good that was a good uh, I wish I had a dumb theater to do sketch shit in again. It's it's fun. Yeah. It's fun to be yeah. able to take a non stand up bit and be able to do it like over and over again. Yeah. Cause you can't always be doing sketch or character shit at stand up. Well it ruins uh, the mood. Talk to Reno Improv. Then my they... I... They're 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 more insular now. They don't really do any stand up things, and they just have like their people. And I don't feel like taking a bunch of classes to try to like get in with them. Oh, well, they were nice to me when I was there. Oh yeah, I mean they let us do uh, let yeah. me and Nick do our show there once, but okay, cool. 
haven't uh mm-hmm. haven't been back since 2020 ish yeah i think okay 2019 2019 fair enough Fuck, that was so long ago yeah oh yeah yeah so uh, yeah everyone oh now we're all bidding. sad Start the bidding on this CD. Oh, uh, I, if... I don't have a CD player either. All the proceeds will go to getting Jonathan a new calculator. Oh, I thought we were gonna <laughs> kill a horse on camera. Yeah, it'll be Just a one, it'll be one of those big Texas black. instrument ones that can like smash a small child's head in. You know, yeah. if we get to a thousand we'll dollars, we will have Jonathan murder a horse with a calculator. Oh. Okay. What? He's done it once and he'll do it again. He craves He's blood. Not done that. He's done it. Don't listen it's to him. Not, it's not true. He's an unreliable narrator. Probably the one method those lawmakers didn't count for. Yeah. Killing horses with calculators. It's just like it's school equipment. It's not a it's weapon. Al- it's always open season with my TI eighty three. Plus. Yeah, you gotta get the plus. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta, play. you gotta have to get one of those graphing calculators. Right. Yeah. The graph. Oh, the one that has that little block man game on it. Yeah. I think they might. Yeah, they might have like a couple of little uh, simple, I... simple games in there. If you get the plus, you can get Doom to run on that little guy. You can get Doom to run on that. You can also get Doom to run on. Uh... What was the other thing you can get Doom to run on? <laughs> I think in simulation, oh. someone got oh. Doom running on the lunar module. From... Oh. Yeah, something crazy like that. <laughs> it's... There's so much, so much shit Doom can run on if you just optimize it. Okay, Jonathan, I'm I'm, I'm not sure if you've found that side of the internet, but people just try to find weird technology and see if they can get the game Doom to run on it. <laughs> like one of them, I saw one that was just like a little like I don't know if it was like Tamagotchi or Hello Kitty, like it was a dumb little screen watch. Uh-huh. It just had like yeah. Doom going on it. Yeah. Nice, yeah. Fuck it. Doom's on everything. It's hilarious. They should get it to work on those uh, overpass sign. <laughs> you know? Pack an overpass sign to have yeah. Doom run Oh, to run Doom on those. Yeah. That would actually yeah. be really cool so, if you drove by one of those giant highway signs and someone was just playing Doom. Yeah, just a yeah. Late live stream Doom. Live stream yeah. speed runs on those digital billboards. That'd yeah. be cool. <laughs> Try to speed run it before the cops show up. Yeah. <laughs> Just stop in the middle of the freeway to watch it. Doom on on government property until we get kicked <laughs> off. Yeah. I see. I want to check out these optimization strats. Just playing playing Doom over Area Fifty One in a bunch of drones just outside their jurisdiction, just so they can't. Shoot them yeah. down. They'll still shoot them down. You can't go do. You can't drone bomb Area Fifty One. No, uh, can't do that. You're not supposed to, but probably that's that's how we're gonna make you kill a horse. So, oh, you're gonna have to control them individually to run and just kamikaze into a horse. I, I however many drones it takes. I think I've only ever killed a rabbit with my car (laughs) on accident, so I'm not good at killing stuff. I'm just saying, you know. Just you know imagine how many rabbits you could kill with your car on purpose. Yeah, that's a good point. But I did it on accident. Yeah. We all believe. So you. you're like an idiot savant when it comes to killing rabbits with your car. <laughs> if that's what you did to it on accident, imagine if you drive with purpose. The possibilities are endless. Yeah. And what if your balls were out? Pull, pull them out. Let's just see. Maybe if you pulled your balls out, you'd kill more. <laughs> 50 dead rabbits. Bobby, I think you just want to see my ball. No, what? Get out of here. Okay. Yeah. Well, guys, that's been the Petri dish. <laughs> no one pulled their balls out this time. That's unfortunate. But uh, I got to go get an infected second butthole. Austin's going to crawl around on the ceiling like Spider-Man. And Jonathan's going to get a third haircut. So. Not with this foot rash, I'm not. Yeah, he's yes. oh god, that's yep. right. Don't get it Stop. on your dick. Yeah. Now I'm gonna figure this out. You're gonna get foot and dick syndrome. All right. <laughs> foot and dick? 
Is that my foot's in my dick sometimes? Girl? It is now. Oh, that happens. okay. 